I'll set pops. Great, thanks. Exams, <laughs> please. <clears throat> Mom, you know I'll ace them. Don't be such a bad influence. And a soft toy, she's already 16. Don't be too hard on him, Rose. I think there's more to the bear that meets the eye. Gareth knows me better than you do, Mom. This guy is just the messenger. <clears throat> it's beautiful. Thank you. One more surprise tonight. What surprise? All I'll say is, don't wear sneakers. Huh? Sneakers, no sneakers. What do you mean my no sneakers? That's all I have. Wow. Just my size. Thanks, bestie. Cass, how does this look? Perfect. A and this? Perfect. How about this? Puff. No, wait. Is that a trick question? That's crap, Isla. Isla! I need help. I'm going to ask Millie out. I'm doing it. Oh, I'm not. Yes, I am. What if she says no? Uh, she's not going to say no. What if she really does say no? Yes, what? yes, yes. You're finally doing it. But how do I ask her in a classy way so there's 0% chance she'll reject me? Classy, you, tough one. I know. I'll do it with flowers. Roses. Four million species of flowers and men only know roses. Not roses, then what? Tulips. I just made this arrangement. You're welcome. Ah! Uh, my hands are sweaty now. The, 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 the sweat killed tulips? Will Millie like the tulips? Just go! Oh! Wear the first dress. It's perfect. Little girl, all grown up. Um, how can say no sneakers? I didn't have any, so I found mom's. I think they were her favorite. She used to wear them all the time. Wait right here. They're beautiful. Are these rosemary's? I don't think we're the same size. These were your mom's favorite. She kept them in a box. She never wore them. She was saving them for a special occasion. But she never got to wear them. Myla, don't wait. Live each day like it's special. Okay, so make sure you come back by midnight. Oh, she just said I'm all grown up. I also said you're my little girl. <laughs> oh, Isla. You look so beautiful. Your mother would be so proud. Thanks, Rosemary. Put them on. Barker will be here soon. Okay. Bye, Pops. Bye, Isla. Watch the steps. Isla Chang, your birthday ball awaits.
Let's see. Haka, you didn't. These people. Relax. No one knows it's your birthday. It's a charity ball. Oh. <laughs> Haka, Mr. Collins was looking for you. He can wait. But Haka. He can wait. Maybe you should go. He's not the boss of me. He will be once you graduate and get called to the bar. There's no guarantee I'll join the firm. You know you will. You won't let your parents down. Just go, I'll be fine. Don't talk to any strange guys, okay? Why not? One of them could be my Prince Charming. <laughs> there are many charming guys here, but there's no prince among them. I know, I know, I'm joking. Just go. I won't get into any trouble. Promise. Okay, okay. Meet me outside in an hour, okay? Okay. Phone? I am gonna set a reminder so you don't get carried away and forget. I wanted to go to a ball. This is a once in a lifetime. This is not your world. Just surrender to it for one night. Enjoy it. Who needs bridge charming anyway? So you're the one. You should be. You've been hogging the chocolate fountain. <laughs> Are you going to arrest me then? Yes. Your name, please, and the name of the person who brought you. I better not say. Interesting. I saw you come in with my buddy Parker. So you already knew who brought me? It was a trick question. Are you his latest? You don't look like his usual type. You're right. I'm not. I'm his... Is what? Nobody. Ah, curiouser and curiouser. Is she bothering you? Yes. No. Kate, do you know her? I saw her come in with Parker. No. She doesn't want to tell me her name. Isn't that suspicious? Everyone has secrets, Nolan. Especially around here. Yeah, but her name. Give her some space. I will. Once I find out who she is. Excuse me. Ah. You better move before I... May I have this dance? If you're trying to rescue me, I don't need rescuing. I'm rescuing Nolan from you. Don't want blood over this nice floor, right? Shall we? What? Why are you so surprised? I mean, it just doesn't go with how you look. You're judging me based on how I look? I didn't think you'd be all gangster and beat Nolan up. You're too... I'm what? Too pretty. Why can't pretty people be... Oh, uh, you think I'm pretty? Has anyone told you that before? Well, my father, but he doesn't count. So you have a father? Hey, you're just like that. That, that Nolan, you just want to dig out secrets. I only dig out secrets of people I like to get to know better. Ow. Sorry. I think you better let me lead. Good idea.
this water? Yeah. Thanks. Hi, I'm Kaden. Yeah, I know. Usually when someone tells you their name, it's a rule to tell them yours. <laughs> Good try. Uh, you don't really want to know anything about me. It's not worth it. I'm quite boring. You are not boring at all. In fact, this is the most fun I've had at one of these parties in a very long time. Your life must be quite sad then. Actually, it is. Is it really? Well, I'm sure you have plenty to be grateful for. Appearances can be deceiving. Maybe you're just looking at life as glass half empty. Maybe you should just take a step back and fully appreciate what you have. I'm just saying, there are plenty of secrets and lies. Well, some secrets are necessary evils. But I do think that things happen for a reason. You might not know what the reason is right now, but one day you'll look back and you'll know that everything worked out for the best. That's very optimistic and idealistic. Well, that's what my mother told me. And she's always right. Your mother sounds very wise. She was. Was. I'm sorry, I... Oh, don't be. I miss her, but I'm really lucky because I have so many happy memories of her. So, uh... Tell me, what reason there is for us two strangers meeting tonight? Well, I... Uh... At least tell me your name. Uh, I I'm so sorry. This is the alarm that my brother said. I have to go meet him now. Now? Yeah, but I'll go tell him I need a bit more time. I'll be right back, okay? Mom! Mom, why are you doing this? Your father needs me. You mean you want to go back to run the law firm? It's only right. In the eyes of the world, we're still husband and wife. What about Gareth? I've already told Gareth. And I'm sure you took it badly, right? He's put up with so much for you. Isla? You're gonna break her heart. They'll understand. They'll get over it. What? It's her 16th? Parker, that's enough. We'll talk about this back home. Rose, let's go. Smell this. Fresh. Right? <laughs> hey, this is a nice one of your mom. It's for my final year project. Very good. <laughs> Who's this? Nobody you know. Uh, so, what's the plan for my birthday, Pops? Ah, I have made reservations. Let's and at home. I know you don't want to make a fuss, but you're turning 21, it's a big deal. We are making a fuss. Okay. I'm making you cook for me. Oh no. Oh uh, yes, a delicious home-cooked meal. Better go buy groceries. I might poison you. Is that how you want to remember your 21st birthday? I'll take that risk. I do so much. Hello? You're here already? Uh, Ayla, can you give me a pot of uh, forget-me-nots? Oh, okay. Uh, but um... Hello! Happy 21st birthday! 
Happy anniversary! Happy anniversary! You're so lucky you're single, Isla. Don't forget to come for your cake later, okay? Thanks. Oh, I've got another call. Bye. Happy birthday, Isla. Hey, um, sorry I can't make it tonight. It's okay. I know you're busy. I promise I'll come see you soon. Don't worry. I just graduated and I've got all the time in the world. Oh, yeah. Um, mom sends her birthday wishes. I gotta go. Bye. Oh, Isla, sorry. I, I forgot they were coming today and I have to make deliveries. It's okay, I can manage. You sure? The photographer promised that they'll be done quick and that the model is already here. No problem. You sure? Go. Pops! See, not sure. I knew it. Ayo, <laughs> you can't be so messy when you're out for delivery. Okay, okay. Hey, this spot is for them. Oh, okay. Here you go. Hello? Should be done really soon. Promise to meet them at the club. Yes, the whole gang will be there. Silver flew in from Zurich yesterday and... Nushka's flight from Vladivostok should be landing any minute now. It's not every day we graduate from finishing school. My mother will have a conniption if it doesn't go according to her plans. Okay, I gotta go. Bye. Nushka. Nushka. Anushka's flying in on a private jet from Vladivostok. Partaking of champagne, caviar and canopies. <clears throat> I'm sorry? Are you really sorry? Uh, no, I'm not sorry I said all that. Just sorry you heard it. I thought so. I'm, I'm really sorry. No, that was amazing, actually. Why do you look and sound so much like me? I was going to ask you the same question. This must be what they call doppelgangers. Oh my god, no one's going to believe this. I'm Evangeline. I'm Isla. What did you say just now? <clears throat> Anushka's flying in on a private jet from Vladivostok. Partaking of champagne, caviar and canapes. Perfect. We need to record this. Hi, I'm Evangeline. No, I'm Evangeline. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Bye, -bye. Imagine wearing them all day. I don't have much of a choice. Everything's pretty much decided for me. My fiance's here. I better go. Isla, thank you for making this a fun shoot. I have something for you. Forget me not. I certainly won't forget you. Thank you. Hi. Ready to go? I'll drop you off at the club before I head back home and pack for the flight. Thanks for coming to pick me. Yeah, no worries. What's that? A present. Forget me nots. You should keep them. I might end up killing them. Surprise! Cancelled all my meetings. Anna, is everything okay? Yeah, everything's fine. Hey, I'm on my way to the airport. Okay, then. Evangeline, what's wrong? Can you please come and get me? I'll be right there. Nah. I came all the way here just for this. See the dad? Oh, leftovers from my birthday dinner. Pop's cooking. This is great. So, how's your birthday been? Mm, good. 
Um, I made a new friend. Who? Model, Evangeline. She's engaged to your friend. Oh, Cade. Yes, Caden. He's good friends with you and Nolan, right? What do you want to know about Cade? Nothing. I was just wondering. Parker, just a hypothetical question. Uh huh. What will you do if um, you've met the person you're meant to be with, but there was someone else? Well, then that person can't be the one you're meant to be with. Who says anyone's meant to be with anyone anyway? Destiny is something that we've invented because we can't stand the fact that everything that happens is accidental. What? That's from my mom's favorite movie, Sleepless in Seattle. Accidental or not, shit happens. If everything's fated, then there's nothing you can do. You kind of earn fate. Evangeline. Bad idea. <laughs> You're right. Look at that sexy. Bye. So you're the girl who believes she can play Evangeline. Hi, I'm Evangeline. Hi, Kate. How are you feeling? I've missed you.